Hello everyone. Today we are starting my bathroom makeover. This is another part of my moving series. This actually might be the first one going up after the move-in vlog. So that's super exciting. So let's start with a little tour of the bathroom. Okay, so you walk in and you see these cabinets. Excuse the mess, you guys. We're gonna fix all of this in this video. So then you walk over here and you see the vanity. Also, this door leads to my living room and then this one leads to my bedroom. So this is kind of just like the little in-between area. We have so much storage over here and so much storage under here, which you guys already know I'm so happy about. And so much counter space. This is amazing. I actually never filmed in my old bathroom because there was probably like this much counter space and it was just very difficult to film in this. There because there was just nowhere to put my camera. There was just nowhere to put anything. Also, excuse like the air mattress. My couch is not gonna be here for a bit, so we're sticking with the air mattress for now. I'm filming a bunch of like moving videos right now, obviously, so I feel like I've said this so many times, but please just like excuse the mess. I'm still getting things organized, but probably in like a week or so, everything will start to look a little bit more normal. Anyways, let's carry on with the tour. I'm just so excited about all this counter space. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with it yet, but this is kind of just all stuff that goes in here that I need to put away that I've just kind of put on the counter for now. Over here, I just have like my toothbrush and a little tongue scraper and then some hand soap and a candle. We have a medicine cabinet, even more storage. So I have my skincare in there right now. I kind of don't love this setup though. So this might change. I don't know yet. And then here we have the actual bathroom part. So we have the toilet. I have this bath mat from Target and I have a little trash can that I got from Home Goods and a little toilet cleaner. Got another towel rack over here. And then here is the shower. I am so obsessed with the marble, but currently all of my stuff is up here because I don't have a shower caddy set up yet. I actually ordered one and it was gonna be a bamboo one that sits right here on the shower head, but it didn't work. So we had to return it and I got some that are like little suction cups that are gonna go over here. You guys will see. So that is the full bathroom area. I think what we're gonna do is start with the shower organizers because I would love to take a shower without having to like reach on my tippy toes to grab all the products that are up there. So let's do that. Okay, so it turns out I'm actually not able to put the on the adhesive strips yet because you have to wait 24 hours So I just put up the strips and then tomorrow around like five or six I can put on the containers So only one more shower left tonight without a shower caddy. Okay next up What I'm gonna do is add this little hook to my wall So it's gonna go right here just right in the middle because there's no like bar to hang a towel And so right now I'm using a handle which is fine But I also want to use a different towel for my face than I do for my hands whenever I'm washing my face or brushing my teeth and stuff like that So I have a little towel set from Jerk Avenue. That's really cute and I'm just going to alternate hanging those on this hook which serves as a cute decoration but is also super functional. I'm also just going to go ahead and hang this up with a command strip instead of a nail because I really don't feel like you need to use a nail for this. Like it's not going to be holding a lot of weight at all. So I might as well just command strip it on there. Should be super easy. you guys it's time to keep working on the bathroom it's the next day and i just did a load of towels so we're gonna put these away i'm gonna put the bath towels in this cover then i just replaced the hand towel right here i have a couple guests coming in the next couple days so it'll be nice to have some clean stuff for them and then this is the set of towels from jerk avenue that i was telling you guys about they are so cute this one also matches my robe which is hanging up on the back of this door this one is my favorite so i think we're gonna start with this one hung up right here like i said this will be my face towel Oh, and then I also have this little one from Daiso and it has a little cat on it. Okay, now let's go ahead and put these up. It hasn't been a full 24 hours. It's been like 21, but that's good enough. It is looking so cute so far. I put my shampoo and conditioner here with my body wash. These will be like the main things that I use. This is like my face stuff. So I use this Good Molecules Instant Cleansing Balm to take off my makeup. It's like an oil cleanser. And then I follow it with this basic one from Curology. Put my razor here and my loofah here. I'll probably put my more like extra self-care related items up here. I actually have a box full of that stuff in the living room here. A lot of this stuff will also probably go under the sink and like in the drawers and stuff. There's a bunch of products in here. So let's just start with the ones that are going in the shower caddy. Okay, I believe this is everything. So let's go organize these. All right, 
they are all organized. So up here, I put a body scrub, some Truly products, a hair mask, more Truly products. These are for shaving, another hair mask, and some aftershave oil. And then I also added this in steam shower facial. I love it so much. I love how organized everything is. Okay, here are the rest of the products in that box that need to be organized. I know that there's a lot. I actually think that I have more in my room. This is an entire bag worth of beauty stuff. There's a lot of just like PR. A lot of this is basically gonna go in the bathroom, but you know what? This is too much for me right now. So let's just start with what I already have out because I feel like I would get overwhelmed if I went through that entire box right now. So I'm gonna grab some containers from the kitchen. I have these ones from Target. One of these is gonna go on the toilet. And then I have these ones from the container store that are left over from the kitchen. I didn't end up needing these. So let's just start going through, putting things in drawers, figuring out what works, what doesn't, and I will update you guys. the counter is looking so much cleaner. In this first drawer, I didn't organize it yet. I just threw things in there that I knew would end up being in there after being organized because I need to get like a little organizer for this drawer. And then in the second one is kind of where I put all the products up here. There's like taller stuff in here, face washes, shampoo, shaving cream, sunscreen, stuff like that. Some mini skincare products, a headband, a little face towel, my cotton pads, an extra razor, this body butter, and then this mouthwash. This bag is all of my nail stuff. And then I put these two little organizers here because I'm sure there's more things that are going to go in here after I look through that box in my room. There's nothing in here yet. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it, honestly. Maybe I'll use it for like PR or something. I kind of did the same thing with under the sink as I did with this drawer. I just threw things down there that I knew would go in here. I just haven't organized them yet. Now let's work on the little basket for on the toilet. I have an Amazon package to open. So I got this toilet spray because Rachel actually had it at my old apartment and I really liked the smell of it and just the look of the bottle. I feel like it looks so like fancy. The scent is coconut and sandalwood and then I got these little baskets from the Target dollar section. I mainly bought it just for this cream one so let's get this set up. Okay I think we're good. So what I'm planning on doing is putting one of these in here and then an extra roll of toilet paper Then I'm honestly not sure what else. I kind of didn't think that far ahead. <laughs> Maybe I'll do like a cute body lotion or something for when you get out of the shower. Even like a candle would be cute. Maybe we'll do this fake plant that will kind of like hang over the edge like that. Let's try it. I kind of don't love it. I feel like something looks a little bit off. I feel like we need some like height in here or something. I do think it's cute though. Like this is an option. Maybe I'll try this body lotion. Okay, I honestly like this, but I feel like people are gonna say to go with the plant instead. Okay, maybe I do like it like this. I'm so indecisive, you guys. Let me know what you think. Okay, I think the next step is to get my toothbrush set up. I bought this forever ago. This is the Philips Sonicare electric toothbrush. It's pink. So cute. I got it on sale. I've never used an electric toothbrush. This is so adorable. Oh my gosh. I need to get my nails done so bad. Just putting it off until I'm kind of like a little bit more settled in because I don't want to break another one building something. Okay, it looks like all I need to do is plug it in. All right, you guys, I went to Target and got so much stuff to organize this bathroom. I found a lot of these things in the dollar section, which was really nice. So I got this little set of drawers. I got these two baskets, this big tub, this little basket with the handle. I got this tub and then this one with the handle. I thought this might be good for like hair tools and stuff like that. I got some smaller stackable organizers and then this clear one, another little one. And then last but not least, I got this bamboo set for on top of the counter. I got this hand towel, which is going to be perfect because it has this little loop up here. And so the other one is just on the handle of this drawer, which I don't like because you can't open this bottom one without it getting in the way. So I'm just going to hang this one on this handle. Not perfect, but it'll do. Okay, that's everything that I got. So let's go through that big box in my room and just organize everything. guys it's the next day and here is the bathroom update it looks a million times better than when we started I'm not gonna lie yesterday I was getting very stressed out just with like organizing things I realized how excessive the amount of like makeup I have is it's so bad so I really want to get together a little like bag to donate to the women's shelter or something or I would love to give some away to you guys too so we will see I will figure that out once I'm a little bit more settled in so here's the update 
great. This is the little counter situation I got going on. I just think this is so cute. I have a very like pastel pink theme going on in here. Then I have my soap over here. I just have some more skincare in here. And then in this drawer, this is all the stuff that I use more often. So here is my normal toothbrush and then a tongue scraper, toothpaste, some hair stuff, some extra toothbrushes, makeup remover, headband for when I'm washing my face and stuff, a little lotion, more lotions in here, some whitening strips, and then I have my toothbrush charger. But you guys have not seen these yet. So a while ago, I don't know if you guys remember, but in a video, I thrifted these two pictures. I think that they are so adorable. And I didn't really tell you exactly what they were for, but now that I live by the beach, I thought it would be perfect to have that classic cheesy beach themed bathroom. And I thought that these were the perfect way to do it because they're kind of just like subtle. They're not over the top screaming beach in your face. They're just so cute. I'm obsessed with them. I feel like they're exactly what I would have wanted. And it matches perfectly with like the pink and blue kind of theme I have going on in this bathroom. So I'm thinking this one is going to go right here. And then this one is gonna go in the actual bathroom behind this door above this towel right here. I wasn't sure if I should put it there or above the toilet, but I feel like it would look kind of weird because it's really low. So why not just have a little something to look at while you're sitting on the toilet? So let's hang them up. are hung. I feel like that actually made such a big difference because the place looks so much more homey now. Like just looking in this mirror, seeing a picture hung up on the wall makes it feel more like my house, if that makes sense. It feels more permanent. I don't know if that's like the word I'm looking for, but wow, I am just so, so happy with how the place is looking so far. This should be the first room makeover video that I'm uploading and you guys will see one for every room in the apartment. Everything is coming together, honestly. You guys have already probably seen a tiny bit of my room and the living room just from this video. But anyways, the bathroom is almost done. I'm gonna get a lamp for right here. I think I might do something about these light switch covers. I kind of want to get some cuter ones because I did that at my old apartment and it actually changed a lot about the way that the room looked. And then I need to get a mat for right here. But right now I want to give the counters a quick clean and like the mirrors and then the toilet and stuff like that. So let's do that. finished with the bathroom. Today I'm kind of just adding some finishing touches. So I have a mini haul for you guys. First, I finally got a little mat to put right here in front of the vanity. I've just been so indecisive with which one to get. So this one is from Target. I also got some light switch covers. So there is a light switch right here. I feel like this just looks so dingy. The color of it just kind of throws this whole area off, honestly, which sounds dramatic, but I feel like having this there instead would just make the whole thing look so much nicer. And then we're also gonna do that with this one right here. And last but not least, I got this little lamp from Ikea. I ordered a couple of these. I actually have a total of three now and I literally wanna buy another one. I just think that this is the perfect lamp. I'll open it up and show you guys. It's so cute, it's small, it's not super expensive and it just gives off a really soft light and I feel like it's just very relaxing. And I'm thinking it's gonna go in the corner right here. Okay, the lamp is plugged in. I just need to figure out a way to hide the cords. Let's start replacing the light switch covers. All right, we got one down. I feel like this just looks a little bit nicer and I just saved the old covers so that I can put them back on when I leave. So let's do the other one. And we're done with both. Last but not least, let's lay down the rug.
let's do a bathroom tour now that it's all done. So walking in, here is what you see. I unfortunately have not finished organizing these cabinets. That has not been on my list of priorities, but we'll get that done eventually. And here is the vanity all complete. I have my Glossier candle lit right now. Then I have my Jerf Avenue towel, my new toothbrush. It matches the towel perfectly. I actually just liked the pattern of this tissue box, so I kept it like that without a cover. And then over here, we have the lamp. I never really figured out what to do to hide the wires, so they've kind of just been tucked back there. And then I have a Sunny Angel right here and my hand soap, my hand towel right here. I kept the medicine cabinet pretty much the same. And then let me show you guys the drawers. This one just has my like everyday products. And then this one, more like extra products. And then more extras down in this drawer. And then in these ones, there's just a bunch more random stuff, honestly. Just some like backup products, hair stuff, stuff like that. And then my little rug. I need to put something under this so that it doesn't move around as much. But then we have the actual like bathroom, shower room type thing. The light in here is so pretty right now. It's so bright at this time of day. I love it. So we have my little basket on the toilet. I decided to keep it like that. Trash can, bath towel, and then all of my products fully organized in here. I've been loving this setup. It has been so nice to have everything so like organized. And every shower I feel like feels so luxurious, especially when I use the products on the top row because those are some more like fancy self-care type of products. These are all just like the basics. You have my bath mat, an extra towel, and then my little picture that I have, which I love so much. I love both of them. I just think they're so cute. But that is it for the bathroom. This is my first completed room makeover video. First of four. And I'm so excited. My apartment really is coming together and it just feels so nice to see it being filled with things that I like and it just feels more and more like home every day. It already did from the beginning, honestly. I love this place so much. But it's just so fun. You guys know how much I love decorating and so I've had such a good time putting together all the rooms and this is the first one that is finished. So actually the kitchen is done. I keep forgetting. <laughs> you guys will see that next. Comment the soap emoji if you stayed up until this point. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys very soon with another video. Bye!